think that they were looking down the road. Yeah, but down the road, thinking of you know Chris Bosco to Miami Great at the same t at the same time. So it, it's just a weird dynamic. But they have a special player with that young man there. And now they swing it around. Boomerangs back to senior, drives around his defender and calling Stein to the rim. No, the follow back over to Dodgers. Great defense by Bledsoe under Duress Hardaway Jr., the mid range jumper ball. Jackson tries to drive around Finney Smith and does. Oh, a graceful glide. Bless Jackson in a foot race with Powell. Lobs it to do behind the back to man. Powell, one of the best rollers in the league. Brunson going to call his own number as he battles with Kennard. Oh, ladles it in to Finney Smith, who punches it home with a right. Cut down the lane for an easy two. Brunson spins away from Kennard, who does well to recover, but Brunson knocks it. Is an indication, too, of really concentrating, getting, again, two feet inside, utilizing athleticism. That's just tough, bro. Terrence Mann is not a weak individual. And Kevin Durant's so dynamic to stop is they don't need to pill all the time to be dominant. Coffee in the corner for three. Out of a clumsy fast break, and it's a turnover. Dallas the other way. Benny Smith down the lane, high off the... It will knock it in. Hardaway Jr., no. Brown, yes, on the second effort. Sterling Brown cuts the lead back down to seven with his first bucket tonight. But we'll see what Dallas does here. Pivotal four-minute stretch in this first half. Nice defense by the Mavericks. Morris muscles his... They go to the traditional post-up for George. Turns and fires, and he knocks down his first shot tonight. Five points for us, his three rebounds for Paul George. Clippers lead by eight. Coffee sets the screen and then flares out on the wing. George draws the foul. Count the basket and send that young man to the line. Only eight teams have won a game this year, shooting less than 40%. The Clippers are one of them. Coffee on a break. Oh, my goodness! The Vulture Soldier throws it down! Doncic picked up by Zoo, looking to go two for one. The three is good, and he backpedals, and he checks the scoreboard, and he cuts the lead down to eight. It was a good start for the Clippers. At one point, led 20 to nine. Dallas has not had a lead here so far in this one. Lob to Finney Smith, reaches up high and lays it home. Doncic, watched by Senior. Step away three for him, boy. He is, he is special. Doncic now with 16. Doncic swings it over to Finney Smith, drives around his defender in Bledsoe. Misses the shot, rebound, tap back out to Porzingis, a straight on three, book it, 56 to 54. Paul George now three for ten. Dallas, believe it or not, a chance to take the lead on this three from Dacic. It's their first cushion of the night, 57-56, Dallas, timeout Clippers. And shooting only 40%, I mentioned this earlier, only eight teams in the league have won by shooting less than 40%. The Clippers are one of them. Cully Stein increases the percentage with a wild shot inside. Biggest lead of the game for Dallas. Lucas skips it over to Hardaway Jr. for three. In and out. Porzingis punches it in on the follow. Why well, two coming out in the zone defense? They're, they're back in the man right now. The Mavericks. You see Paul George off just manipulating the defense, maneuvering inside. George draws a crowd. Five to shoot. Reggie's going to have to dawn a cape. Flings up a three. Oh, he does it again. Big government with the bailout one more time for the Clippers. He was questionable back in the first half. Doncic to Hardaway Jr. And the three is good. And Hardaway Jr. is a one-shot hot type of player. Doing some work at the free throw line. Four of five. 68-65. Doncic a contested three by Hartstein. I mean, my goodness. Here in the third quarter with 3.05 to play. Trying to put length on Doncic. He gets around Hartenstein with a kiss and a smile. He knocks it down. 26 for Luka Doncic. George hands it off to Kennard. 10 to shoot. Jackson. Awkward like shot. Counted at a foul. Don't sleep on Trey Burks. He can score. Crosses over Hartenstein. Gets to his spots. And broadcasters chinks in place. Knocks it down. And they lead once again by three. 
Jackson puts on the brakes. He retaliates and knocks it in. Six seconds separates the two timers. It'll be Dallas ball to start the fourth. Will it be Clippers lead? Brown shedding defenders inside and lays it in. Brown beats the buzzer. Momentum and the scoreboard belong to Dallas. Porzingis posting on Bledsoe. This is what Tyloo wants to happen. Porzingis makes them pay. Bledsoe cuts off his own path, flings it up top to Kennard for three. Yeah, Hearts on hand options. Luke Kennard, coffee, but he chose to take it himself. An excellent passing that time by the Mavericks to get the ball in the middle of the court. Coffee gets a break, but seven points, two assists, and two rebounds for him. Very nice effort. Hardaway Jr. for three. It's good. To the Clippers. Stops and scores in that order, and Kleba just gets right to the rim and Jackson. It goes 28 for Reggie. George to man. Shoot it. To Kennard for three. Five point game. They get it to George, the three is en route. Long rebound to Jackson, hoisting up the triple, it's good. They need a three to send this one into overtime. George, the step away for the tie! Oh my goodness! Right. Into Porzingis, but he misses at the doorstep, recovers and lays it in for the first basket in overtime. Nard. Good ball movement, Kleba, a gifted three-point shooter, knocks it in. Five quick points to start overtime for Dallas. Porzingis, oh my goodness, cut through four. Porzingis is a completely different player than what we saw in the two playoff series for Dallas. Explodes around the defense of Kennard, shoots over the top. It is 112-104, Dallas 109 to play. Rebound goes to Doncic after trailing by 11 in the first quarter. The Mavericks led by 10. Paul George forces overtime with the...